So here in Moodle, we're going to have a look at how we can add Lockdown Browser to a quiz or an exam. So the first thing to check is on the right hand side, do you have the Lockdown Browser dashboard visible here? Um, if you don't see these dashboards on the right, then just make sure that they're visible. You can do that by clicking this little circle with the four arrows in it, and it will reveal and hide the dashboards on the right. And then we need to turn editing on. Once editing is turned on, we're going to scroll down on the left and come to add block. We'll click add block here and we're looking for the Respondus lockdown browser. So when we click that, it will add the dashboard across on the right hand side. And it's in the dashboard rather than in the quiz itself that we add lockdown browser settings. So we're going to come to Respondus lockdown browser on the right here, click on the dashboard and then we will scroll down to the quiz that we want to add lockdown browser to and come to the settings. And there's two main options here. One is the lockdown browser. So we're going to require that. And then the other is proctoring. We're not going to cover proctoring here today, but basically once lockdown browser is turned on, you'll want to check your advanced settings, make sure there's nothing in here that you will need. So for instance, students are taking their exam on an iPad, or if you want to lock them into the exam until the exam is completed, you can check those settings. And then also if you are linking to external or specific external web domains or an online book, then you can check this option here. And there's some more things to consider there in terms of how students are accessing that content. If you embed PDFs or PowerPoints into your quiz, then you can allow students to open those within Lockdown Browser without any other settings. It'll basically open them in a new tab and students will be able to refer to those during the quiz or exam. So if we hit save and close now, We'll come back to the home page of our course and scroll down. And you can see now when we click here, it's going to say that this quiz has been configured so students may only attempt it using Respondus Lockdown Browser. And what the students will see if we come up and change our role to a student. And so at this point, this is what students will see when they come into the Lockdown Browser. They'll need to download it if it's their first time using it. And for this, we'd recommend that you run a practice quiz with no consequence so that they can get the Lockdown Browser installed, set up, make sure it works on their system. And then they'll just click Launch Lockdown Browser and that will take them into the quiz in the Lockdown Browser. It will close down any other software and it won't allow them to access any files on their computer while they're taking the quiz until it's completed. If you do have any questions, then please leave them below. Otherwise, I hope this is useful.